I mean, springs consisted of a lot of positional training for about uh, eight weeks. Then we moved into team practice. Now we're in 20 hour a week. Uh, play in three tournaments, so it's nice for them to, to see what they're working on in practice, if that's transferring over to game situations. And it is. I mean, we played last weekend and we beat both Purdue and Tennessee, and that was no matter when you play them during the year, you know, to beat two quality teams like that shows that we're taking some steps forward, gives our kids confidence uh, and more motivation to get back in the gym and get better. Yeah, I think, you know, we've stayed so much on process versus outcome this spring. And to play Indiana State in that very first match of the day and to come out, we told them the way we were going to evaluate the day was body language, communication, movement, things like that that is controllable and not an outcome of I scored this point, we won this set, um, because that's what spring is all about, about getting better. And when we came in after that match, we realized that we had a lot of score watchers, um, a lot of frustration when they made errors and things like that. So the great thing was an hour and a half, we play again, and it looks like a totally different team. So it'll be nice to play them again, because Indiana State's a quality team and a quality opponent. So to be able to come back out, focus on the right things, and see hopefully a different result from that process will be a good step forward. Um, we're not the biggest team in the Big Ten, and so we feel like to be successful, we need to be play with a lot of speed. So even noticing today in practice, the speed of our offense right now is really, really good. Probably the fastest of anyone in the Big Ten. And with that, it gives us a lot of opportunities for swings against blocks, with split blocks, one-on-one -on -one blocking situations. And I think that really helped us on Saturday to really see that, that those things really matter. So with speed, though, becomes great movement in between, like staying ahead of the game. So we've worked a lot with our strength coach on, on movement type things, on core activities, on flexibility, all those type of things that I think are really making a big difference.